Good morning from Charles again. Whew, slept good. Breakfast number two. Another beautiful day at Shaw's. And film much today. I've been working on the edits, trying to get caught up. Didn't do any editing like the last two days in the hundred mile. So trying to eat, get caught up. Got a couple new pieces of gear I'm gonna talk about in a little bit as soon as I finish this next video. So I decided to get a new pack. Uh, my Hyperlite was at Junction 40. It had the rip. Um, and I had that really nice girl sewed it up for me in the 100 mile. I really appreciate it, but I just don't trust it. Like, I'm not going to get rid of it. I'm going to hold on to it. And when I get home, do a better sew job and keep it for, you know, a certain type of backpacking trip. But, um, yeah, I've been looking at this pack for a long time. My buddy back in uh, Asheville. Asheville near Hot Springs, I think, had one and uh, I really liked it. So I could have went back to the 70 liter Hyperlite that I had at the beginning, but I wanna save that one for winter hikes and like sections where I plan on carrying a lot of stuff. So I feel like it has a purpose and I don't wanna use it right now. Another big reason I wanted to get this pack is because I'm interested in getting as minimal as possible. A big part of why through hiking is like cool to me is because you know you're trying to be minimalist and have the least amount of stuff that you can and showing yourself that you can still be happy with so little is you know spiritually rewarding so moving down to the 35 liter i'm excited about it um changing up a few little gear items sending my thick puffy home got this uh apex enlightened puffy packs down a lot better and it's gonna work it's gonna be you know a lot warmer if it gets wet so more conducive to summer conditions summer rainy conditions so, yeah oh yeah i got a button up too this isn't new this is just an old shirt that i had magellan uh i wish it had a hood on it that would be nice like the jolly gear shirts but i don't guess it's necessary there is Jolly Gear shirts in here. Though. They have everything in Poets Gear Emporium. It's like a really dope outfitter. Probably the best in Maine. See how she fits. This thick mountain hardware puppy has been amazing, but it's getting hot. Time to send her home. Should give me plenty of room in this new 35 liter. <laughs> so it was kind of a busy day had some really good conversation met a lot of good people a lot of northbounders a lot of southbounders a lot of people coming through here right now I had another fire tonight got to see hawk and owl cat again that was awesome um yeah really good day I'm gonna spend another day here tomorrow at least. I might take off tomorrow night, probably the next morning though. So I'm trying to fatten up as much as I can. Like that many days in the woods without any like ice cream or town food, I feel like hit me hard. So <sighs> this is definitely the spot though. Like without a doubt, my favorite hostel on trail.